hello there everyone and the previous video we just got started with anaconda we talked about conda package manager and we update with, with the command of conda update conda in order to check various python packages or libraries installed in our anaconda environment we just type conda lists and we get all the packages installed in our anaconda environment so these are the packages so in this video we'll get started with spider so in order to get start spider you just double click here and spider will start interesting there's anaconda on spider web okay here it is so since it's your new environment you see there is a console here you can see ipython console it states python 2.7.11 anaconda 2.4.164 bit this will show as per we have installed the version the latest one is 2.5 and if it's 32 bit it will show 32 bit and the ipython version is 4.0.1 so this is your console you can type anything 6 plus 7 you get 13 like a normal python console and this is your kernel it will connect your python console to your uh, to the program which you write in the script so first we'll get started we'll just write new project and it says the current workspace has not been configured yet do you want to do this now and yes we want to do this it's okay and you see by default in when you install python or anaconda in the doc my document uh, folder a folder name python script will be created so we want to create our spider workspace in this folder itself so we select this folder and we click on select folder so it's saying there is no workspace in this directory do you want to create a new workspace and yes we want to do it now we have selected our workspace now we go to file and go for new project and it will ask for a project name so you can give project name as per your wish since we are uh, we'll be installing Tiano and Keras over this we are not getting much into a general python tutorial so i'll give a name as Tiano and i'll click ok so you see here we have created our project name Tiano and there are no files in here so we can't see anything and if you want to create any new python script in this project you just right click new and go for file and you just type the name uh, say my script maybe my script but you need to give a dot py extension in order to make a python script so it will say my script dot py and location you see it's in python script in a project named Tiano where there is a spider project workspace already created so we save it and tada we got our script here we got it here so this is your script ready and you can write anything you wash wish like what uh, print maybe this is the easiest command I remember <laughs> so I use it often print let's get started okay and if you want to run this script you just click on this run file or f5 okay yeah and you see this uh, this one let's make it big you can move it ipython console i just yeah so this ipython console the object inspector the variables we created the file so we need ipython console here so there are two ways you know just if you want to s run a selected line just click on this right click run selection or current line so you can see this is the command and this is the output let's get started or if I make a variable a equal to 2 b equal equals 3 and c equals a plus b ok so if I run only this three lines right click run selection or command line so c equal to a plus b if you want to see the output of c just click c 
and 5 it is and in the variable explorer file you can see all the variables which you have created uh, you can see it it is to okay b and c so you can view the variables here let me get back and if you want to run the entire script at once just click this button or f5 okay execute in current ipython console yes yes let, let it just finish okay run so it's going run file and let's get started because if i if i make it print c print c so i run it so get, let's get started and file so you got the idea of how to run a python script here and with this button and another interesting thing here is yeah this button i'll show you suppose you want to make separate segment for each thing suppose this i want to make it a separate segment so you just have to write hash percentage percentage so this become a separate segment and if i want to again separate it then again hash percentage percentage so now this is a separate segment and this is a separate segment if we click this button then it will run the entire script at once but if we click this button it will run the current cell as it says run current cell or control plus enter so in order to run this cell you just click anywhere in this cell and click this button so you get only this cell let's get started now suppose you want to run this cell so you just click anywhere in this cell and this button and it says print c5 now this is very helpful actually when you are writing a uh, huge number of codes and you can check one segment by segment i'll show you when i get into the cnn program this is just for getting started right so i hope you got some idea of how you're getting into python script and this one you can see the variable explorer here the console and this kernel will be linking this script to this console and you can create any new file by new file and another name my script 2.py and save it so you see here it is you can select this you can select this here okay and if you want to create a new project file new project project <coughs> name maybe piano 2 okay so you got a new project and same way you can create as many project as many files you want so hope you got a little idea we'll get more into this if you want to close it just close it do you want to save changes yes i want to and there's another way in which we can launch spider uh, through anaconda prompt so what you have to do is so just type here spider that's all just type s p y d e r and enter and it will launch your spider you see and now i'll show you one more thing suppose you have one spider script running already and you want to run another one so if you type spider again then it will be showing spider is already running if you want to open a new spider instance please type this so what we have to do if you want to open a new spider instance just type spyder space dash dash new it's not underscore it's dash hyphen and then dash instance okay just enter and it will open another spider instance for you so you see there are two running already two other one and two okay so we'll continue in next video more into scripting and spider and all that so thank you for a while <laughs>